We are right now at the Radio Half Sap in my land. This is my story. I'm electronics doctor, refurbisher, and um, um, a man that revives dead radios. You can't find any more radios in the stores because you have the smartphones that as, they look as dead as anything else. We don't find any more radios that you can uh, touch the button and turn it, the knob and turn it. Uh, you cannot look at the needle moving and even the sound of the old radios a little scratch here, a little scratch there, would say, ah, this is radio. <music> Students have come in and they said, sir, can you teach me how to fix an old radio? And my answer is, it will take you about 40 to 50 years to learn. Uh, when I pick up a radio, I turn it on or I plug it in and the way it smells, the way uh, it sounds or doesn't sound, and the way it crackles and, and, and fades away, all these things uh, are recorded in my brain and I know exactly how to start and how to fix it. And we have needles, record player needles that go back to 100 years. We lost the, uh, the ability to touch things, fix things, repair them, and feel good for doing it. And what's replaced it? Automation, plastic, recycling uh, everything we have rather than fixing them. This is a lost uh, generation of electronics man. I'm I'm not that young. <laughs>